Thank you for joining me here on the Mother of Wands channel. My name is Volami, and in this video, I'm gonna be doing what I'm calling the two minute to row messages. Basically, I pulled out some cards here and I'm gonna go over their messages in the next couple of minutes and how they might be relating to some of the astrological aspects happening today. We do have the moon opposing Venus and the sextiling over to Mars, all before we really wake up in the morning. It's all happening before 3 a.m. And then Mercury is making a sextile over to Saturn. And this is a really interesting time where we're really focused on the future and what that could mean for us. But we see this coming out in the Tarot is that, you know, the uncertainty that we're all facing right now. So the first card that came out was the Fool. The Fool is coming out reversed saying there might be some things that we wanted to start on, but we're feeling a little bit held back, a little bit delayed on that start. Like we don't exactly know where to go um, or how to get there, but we know what we want. We know the ultimate outcome that we're working towards with this Ten of Cups. We know where this Fool is headed. We just don't know when the fool can take the first step in that direction. And this is causing two tens here, right? This is talking about a gateway, a portal, an opening of something new. And this 10 here is saying that because we know what we want and how to get there, but we just don't know when we're going to be able to start on it. There's some blocks, some delays. This has this feeling um, a little bit stabbed in the back is the obvious one with this one, but it also has this feeling um, defeated in some sense, but it's not a final defeat. There is something that can come after that. This defeat for some of us out there might be due to the fact that this two of cups here is reversed, saying that we're not able to communicate and get along with other people in a physical sense in the way that we desire. We're kind of kept to um, reaching out through the phone or through emails or through the internet and things like that. We're not able to actually meet in person to help to fill one another's cup. So this is causing even exacerbating this sense here of, um, of disappointment, of feeling defeated in a way. But then we have the devil card coming out also in a reversed situation. So this devil reversed is talking also about how this is showing us what attachments we have to things and what we need to let go of. Do we have attachments to people, places, things, possessions, um, habits with checking our phone, checking the news, certain things like that, that are holding us back that need to be broken in this period of time. That's what this card is really asking us, you know, is looking at our attachments that we might be having and are they healthy? And beginning to look at our attachments with our possessions and our ideas as if they're a relationship that we have with a person and checking, is it healthy or is it not? And then we have, of course, this guy, which I'm not surprised to see, the Four of Pentacles coming up, which is, you know, this is saying that with the way that things are and not being sure of when we could take that first step towards our ultimate goal, dream, destination, we're wanting to hold on to things more tightly than normal now. Now, that is a good thing, but at the same time, this card warns that if you hold on too tightly, that could restrict your income as well, your in, inflow of good energy. So you don't want to restrict your outflow of good energy. Don't overspend. This is definitely what this says. Not a time for overspending, but you, this isn't a time for hoarding or holding on to things too tightly either. It's a time for looking at, again, your relationship with how you hold on to things that you have due to security, what helps you to feel more secure. So this is kind of a day, a day and a time where we can check in with our relationships and how they're helping us to feel. And we see that with um, with Mercury there, with Saturn, you know, this sextile is really talking about how we communicate our needs, our wants, and our desires inside of a confined space. And with the moon opposing Venus, this is saying too, looking at our relationships and ones that might not be serving us very well. So that's kind of the theme of today. Getting, you know, we, we I feel like the most of us are pretty clear about what we would like to be doing. We just know that we don't have the ability to be doing it exactly in that way right now. And so we're being called instead to look at our relationships to the things around us right now that are providing us with security and looking, engaging with if they're healthy or not. That's what I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for being with me here every single day. And until next time, I am singing so much bliss in your direction.